Welcome to the fascinating world of sprayer valves. Today, we're uncovering the secrets behind these crucial components. From small, simple lawn sprayers to large agricultural sprayers, valves serve an important function. Often, there are multiple valves and valve types on a single sprayer. They allow the user to set their operating pressure and direct flow to the spray gun, boom, agitation jet, or any other accessory that may be on the sprayer. There are manual ball valves, electronic valves, regulating valves, gate valves, check valves, and more. A simple lawn sprayer will typically have a ball valve or two and a manual regulating valve. More complex sprayers with automatic rate control as well as rinse and agitation options will have multiple electronic ball valves, manual ball valves, three-way valves, check valves, and a regulating valve. Manual on-off ball valves, a staple in most sprayers, feature an internal ball linked to a handle that turns to open or close the valve. A gate valve can be used to throttle or adjust flow in an agitation line or another accessory. The name gate comes from the mechanism within the valve, which moves up and down like a gate to open or close the flow path. Electric valves offer remote control over where fluid is directed. There are two basic types of electric sprayer valves, solenoid and motorized ball valves. You can learn more about the difference in the article linked below. A regulating valve is used to adjust the flow and pressure in a sprayer. There are manual and electronic regulating valves. Electronic regulating valves are used to automatically adjust the sprayer's output as you increase or decrease your speed. A check valve allows flow of liquid in one direction while preventing the backflow of the liquid. This prevents chemicals from flowing back into the main supply tank or water source. They can also be used to stop dripping from spray nozzles when the pump is shut off. Thanks for watching. Be sure to visit our website to learn more.